number one, uh, you obviously sitting in a good position here going into the second half. You haven't lost in the corner conference at all. What's What's been going good for this team? Uh, we've just been working well together, um, sharing the ball, and then taking opportunities when we have the ball. Tell me about, uh, tell me about uh, the, uh, uh, you know, you lost to Underwood to start off. What, did you guys, what happened in that game? Did some, uh, are they just a good team? Uh, they were a good team, but uh, we, always, we didn't play our best. We struggled rebounding that game. Uh, we just had the first game jitters. I mean, but yeah, they were a pretty good team. Last year, you guys make it all the way to the Substate Final, and you're playing right with Nottaway Valley, even led late, I think. Uh, tell me about uh, how you, that game, how maybe that has been a kind of a motivator, momentum builder for you to this year. Yeah, it's another game we struggled in rebounding with. So then that's been a big thing that we've been working on in practice this year is rebounding. And so that's just helping us there. You guys have had success in pretty much every sport. Uh, I mean, basketball, you haven't been to state in a long, long time. Do you guys just expect, I mean, not that you expect it, but I mean, when you walk into a game, you expect to win pretty much every game. Just, to, I mean, is that kind of the, uh, I guess, the uh, what's going on in your guys' head right now? Are you guys just feeling confident about any sport? Um, we're just going, we don't really expect to win, but we're just going to try and do our best and uh, just beat the other team. Tell me about, uh, you know, you're a good football, great football player too, great basketball player. What is your favorite sport? Probably going to have to go with football. Football? Okay. In terms of uh, future plans, and I know you're just a junior, is that where you're looking? Yes, for sure. Uh -huh. Okay. And are you going to go to Northwest Missouri State too? Uh, I don't know yet. Uh -huh. Tell me about the uh, family uh, situation there. You know, you got two older brothers that both uh, excelled in sports and especially in football. Uh, tell me about following those guys' footsteps. What you learned from those guys growing up? Um, pretty much just keep working hard, especially in the weight room. Uh, a lot of it's in the weight room over the summer, so you just got to keep working there. Along those same lines, the weight room here at, FN, at Fremont Mills is huge. Tell me about the, uh, the example or what uh, Coach Ernster asks of you guys each and every single day. Oh, it's great. Ernst is always a good spirit uh, in there. And he always, I mean, when he lifts with us, and he's always finding uh, different ways to pump us up. So that's good. Not that you've ever missed a weightlifting session, but what happens if you do? Uh, not much. Uh, <laughs> coaches just look at you different. Yeah, too much. Yeah. Tell me about the Afro, uh, because, we, you know, it's, it's getting well known around here. Parker Powers originally made it famous. So why did you, I mean, why didn't you just uh, carve a new uh, niche, a new haircut in there instead of just copying him? Uh, it seemed to be working for him now, <laughs> making him look good, so I thought I'd give it a try. Is it ever going to be cut this year in basketball? Well, no, I don't know if about during basketball, but it was cut after uh, football, but it grew back pretty quick. Yeah, it really did. Did you uh, uh, ever think maybe like hairspray poofing that up a little bit? Uh, once or twice, yeah. <laughs> Sam, you ready to, uh, again, no dunks, but you ready to play KMA? Yes, I am. Go, uh, might have to beat you twice, huh? 